the seaside. All right. I guess let's see what this is all about. It's called Outcast. Hi. Are you the chief of the village? You? You look like a world traveler. An action-oriented fellow. My name is Tanak, and I am the leader of Sapa. Can I ask you something? I'm an open book. Shoot. I don't need a book, but shooting? Yes. Shooting is exactly what I'm looking for. How much for the gun? Sorry, Tanak. It's not for sale. Sorry. Let me clarify. I need the hand attached to the gun. Your hand. Pulling the trigger. I'll pay you. Um. What do you want me to aim at? The Gamors. Mating season's over and they're hungry, of course. So they're coming back to Sapa to feast on us. Can you get rid of them? Depends. What's a Gamor? Four-legged scavengers. Laser sharp teeth, deadly claws. Faster than a harpoon. Gamors. All right, calm down. I will help you. I'm sure they're still slower than a bullet anyway. Okay, uh, Sapa. What's so special about this little settlement you have here? It's beyond special. This little settlement is the gateway to the seas of Adelpha. It's a community of fine, upstanding fisher talent and... Oh, who am I fooling? The community dwindles by the moon. Our economy tanked once the invaders closed the Taoka, and the only fish left are Senegtas. Okay, what is this Sen Senecta? I've never tasted Senecta before. You like it? Do I have any other choice? Those nasty carnivorous fish have become our main source of food. Mainly because they ate all the other fish. Something to do with the temperature of our waters. But Am explains it better than I do. Talk to him if you want to know more. Uh, da Daoka. How can I turn the Daoka back on? Portals are powered by old energy cores, free to land technology, and the invaders confiscated them all. So we are kind of stuck here. Anyone who tries to retrieve the core gets reverted by the invaders, including my dear, dear brother. So we just stop thinking about it. They must be keeping it in one of their bases. There you go, action man. Get that brain working. I've forbidden the Talans from going near the closest base, but if you, uh, if you want to steal back the power core and power the Daoka, I wouldn't be mad. I'd be happy. Right, okay, and who are you? What's your name? I am Tanak, leader of Sapa. Okay. I'll come back later. Uh, quest map. Okay. Alright, we got 20 minutes to do as much as we can. Whoa! What the? What's up, Celeb? Hi there. If you're looking for Zaleb, you found him. But the big question is, why? Why do you want to see me? Are you bringing some lampe? Lampe? You mean like alcohol? If alcohol is a drink that makes you feel lighter, then yes. Trust me, I could use a drink too, Zaleb. But I'm as dry as you are. Hey, um, Sapa. Tell me about Sapa. It's a lovely village you have here. Reeks a bit of fish, but hey, who wouldn't kill for an afternoon at the beach, right? What kind of monster would kill for a beach? It sounds more like a compliment in my language. Some things get lost in translation. 
You think of Sapa, you think of the beach, the sea, I get it. But Sapa is also the soil, plants, beasts, the air we breathe, all connected into one fragile ecosystem, a mother to us all. If you bring war to Sapa and start killing for beaches, you'll have a problem with me, understand? I'll add it to my list. The odds got me solving problems left and right. Uh, you're just like Tanakh and Baram and all the other fisher talons. They don't care about the ecosystem. All they care about is how the Senectas are having their ochre stock. But their reproduction cycle is only the peaking part of the Reesburg. The Reesburg? It's an expression. It means that there is a part you see and much more to it that you don't see. Right. Go on. They need to focus on the big picture, which is, everything is connected. Take Tanakh, for example. He's all worked up about catching Gamors when it's Ventilopes he should be focusing on. Okay, well there's a Ventilope. What's wrong with the Ventilopes? Nothing wrong with the Ventilopes, you dumb Gorgor. It's us that's the problem. And them, the damn invaders shooting down those poor beasts left and right. How can I heal a Ventilope with a hole where its face used to be, huh? Could you tell me that? Look, I got nothing against Ventilopes. Or you. The Ventilopes catch Senectas. Senectas give Sapa life. The sacred mother provides. Our fragile ecosystem thrives. Yeah? Hmm. Intelligent creatures. Yeah. You see the power of a Ventilope. Need to go long distances? Simply hop on a Ventilope's back. Need to chase away hungry Gamors? The Ventilope is your beast. Ventilopes! The village seems pretty vulnerable without them. These hands can only heal so many. Without Ventilopes, I tell you, there is no Sapa. Okay, and uh, tell me about the Dauka. How can I activate the Dauka? As soon as that thing is back on, other Shamazes will be barging in through the portal. Busting my balls with their spiritual this and spiritual that. I'll take a rain check. You know, the Daoka could be a good way to get you Lampe. All the Lampe you want, I bet. You said you were missing the sweet taste of it. Lampe is spoiled by Daoka travel. Everybody knows that. But I could use the Daoka to travel to Beda and have a drink there. Now that's an idea. All right, stranger. If you activate Beta's Daoka as well as our own, we can become friends, you and I. The invaders keep the core of Sapa's Daoka in their base. It's the one closest to us. Thanks, Salop. And, uh, okay, so... Who are you? My name's Slade. Cutter Slade. And you are? Bored. Getting bored. But you can call me the Beast Healer. Okay. They call me that because I, uh, you know, Zaleb heals beasts. I'll stick with Zaleb, if you don't mind. Hmm. Tell me about Gamor. Are the Gamors bothering you? Gamors are perfect predators. Ferocious, fearless. They hunt in packs. But they're not the problem. They're a manifestation of the problem, which is, hello, our upside down ecosystem. Have you been listening to me one iota? Okay, uh, tell me about Baram. Who's Baram? Baram is a fisher talon, boat maker, nautical philosopher, obsessed with the sea. They should put gills on him so he can sleep with the Sankar. Okay, tell me about the uh, Senecta. What about Senectas? Senectas? Uh, big fish. Sometimes dangerous. Don't take a swim with them with food in your pockets and you'll be fine. Baram is the expert. Talk to him about it. Okay, tell me about Tanakh. How is Tanakh? Mm, don't know how he got to be Sapa's chief. A little loopy, but practical. Not too crazy about all the spiritual crap, so I like him. But he forgets the big picture. Everything's connected in a delicate ecosystem. Uh, 
Okay, and uh, what are you doing? What's your role in all this? Here we go. Yes, I'm the Shamas of Sapa, despite the appearances. Yes, I can heal you if you get hurt. No, I won't discuss the yards or the virtues of the essences for countless hours because the truth is I don't give a zort. Not my life. What is your life then? I heal beasts with plants and concoctions, and my Ka essence has nothing to do with it. I feel close to beasts, despite the mockeries of the other Shamazes. Beasts are more loyal than Talons. You don't even dress like a Shamaz. I ditched the dress for something that fits who I am. I don't have anything to do with the other Shamazes. Don't miss them at all. No, nope, not at all. Right. Can you patch me up? Can you be more careful next time? All right, don't move. And just like that, he's gone. Yep. All right. Okay. Well, we got someone else to talk to over here. How's the tide today? The what? Well, aren't you a fisherman? We call ourselves Fisher Talans. We fish for Senecta. My name is Baram, and you are... Call me Cutter Slade. Good to meet you, Baram. Okay, tell me about the Sapa. Is fishing Sapa's main thing? Yes, it is. We've been living in isolation since the invasion started, and we fish to survive. Synectus tastes like roasted soy, but we have to do what we have to do. In a way, we have everything we need here, or almost everything. Almost? I heard Yunair is missing. Sapa can't survive too long without a tamer. Okay, uh... Tell me about Yunair. When is the last time you saw Yunair? Yunair. It's been too Whatever. Long. I don't know what he's doing. We need more fishing ventilopes to take over from the ones that are hurt or resting. Okay, Fisher Talon. I used to go fishing with my uncle. Can I see the types of rods you guys are using? What do you mean? Fishing rods? I mean, you must be using them to. Oh, you mean fishing paddles? Nope. Pretty sure paddles are for paddling. I don't know what your uncle taught you about fishing, but you got it all wrong. <laughs> Look, here's how it's done. Well, that's a bit rough. Ooh. Okay. I accomplished. Oh. Hello. It's beautiful around here. Enjoying Sapa? Just remember that the beaches are closed until further notice. That's okay. I'll work on my tan later then. Thanks. Your fishing technique is original, but too slow. Sometimes you have to hit so hard to stun a Zenecta that it rocks the boat upside down. Fishing for Zenecta is much more dangerous than catching the smaller fish that we used to. No matter how many scrolls I read, I can't solve this problem. Maybe I could use my jetpack to skim across the sea and stun the Synectus. That should speed up the task. Uh, I'm not doing all that. Good talking to you, Bram. Same here. Okay. How 
are things, Zalad. Hanging in there? Hanging? Not every Aga Kaman expression translates into Agazork, you know. Right. Can you tell me where I can find you, Nair? Can you tell me where I can find your balls? They seem to be missing. Oh. My. Okay. I will assume this is a translation issue. I'm looking for the beast tamer. I'll be out of your hair as soon as I find him. Out of my hair? Does it look like I have hair? I don't know where Yunair is, and I don't care. Happy? Right. Can't you sober up for one second? I am sober. That's my main issue right now. Lampe would change my mood, but no deliveries from Vida since the Daoka went down. Stupid invaders. Right, okay. That's all for now. I gotta get this Dauka it's up and running. To be a long moon. <laughs> all right. Let's get to work. Cutter Slade. I am the outcast. Uh -uh. Nice. Perfect. Now, oh, that's not too bad. Nice. Oh, what the I smell nicer things. I'm not sure what this is, but it looks useful. Nice. Try that. Let's see what that shrine's about. Is there something up there?
interesting. I'll find a way to the shrine. Don't you worry. Check it. Oh, something's after me. I didn't know I was supposed to chase it. I wasted so much time just staring at it. Wait. Did it work? No. Whoa. I didn't know I could fly. That hurt. That screwed my time all the way up. D oh my gosh, dude. Why didn't you stop flying? That's going to irritate me. Don't start this bull. It's a freaking demo. Does it need to be this ridiculous? That thing's jank.
Got him. Dang. I feel like a million bucks. I hate. Now. Let's go do this. <laughs> we wasted so much time doing that. this. the whole battalion, huh? Let's turn that off. The shield device is reacting to it. Come on, big boy. Oh. Force field is still active. So I gotta get back to the village.
that thing up there. Okay. Do it. Let's go tell him we did our part. I need to talk to you, Tanak. I'm listening. Have you heard? The Daok is working again. Yeah, amazing. Kinda. Kinda. Well, I thought you'd be excited. Well, when you have ventilopes, why do you need a Daoka? Am I right? Anyway, the rest of the Delta is crazy. The tourists come in, a Senator bites one in the crotch, suddenly we're closing beaches, and oh, don't get me started. Maybe Sappa was better off without. The perks of a quiet fishing village. Why do the ventilopes hang around Sappa? I haven't seen much of them anywhere else. Ventilopes love to eat fish heads, and we love to eat every part of the fish but the head. So it's what you call the perfect partnership. I'll come back later. Right. You know, let's ask this dude some questions. Get some more lore about this place. <sighs> Morning. Hey there. Tell me about the ventilope. Tell me about the ventilopes. A fish of Talan's best friend. We ride them to catch the nectars coming up at the surface of the water. But Zala could tell you a lot more about them and how they fit into Sapa's ecosystem. Ventilopes don't eat what they catch? They love to eat the nectar heads. We love to eat everything else. Works out well. Mother Nature is quite a designer. That is a strange name for a female. Okay, well, tell me about Tanak. What kind of leader is Tanak? A bit kooky, scatterbrains, better at peace than at war. He has his hands full with recent gamma ray attacks. Doesn't have much time to focus on anything else. Our whole ecosystem got messed up since the Spear of Kizar was activated. Everything's connected. What's the deal with the Spear of Kizar? The Alma Yell created an energy field around the island of Kizan, so no invader could reach it. I understand why they want to keep those inside safe, but in the long run, the energy beam is heating up the sea, causing Sednectas to look for cooler waters where they can live and reproduce. Meaning here, on the coast of Sapa. Exactly. Who are you again? What are of Sapa. I'm what you call a coastal engineer. You like to drink lampe? Oh, I get it. Because I'm a fisher talon. I'm also a drunk. That cliche is a little tired, don't you think? I studied marine engineering in Procreana, you know. Earned two golden scrolls there. I didn't mean it like that. Sorry. Salad is something else. Not your typical Shemaz. Zalab is certainly original, I'll give you that. He uses his essence to heal animals, which is nice. Don't tell Chief Tanak, but I even saw Zalab fix a Gamor's injured leg once. Aren't Synectus dangerous? Only if they're threatened, which is getting more common. The bay's full of them. 
We fish to eat them, but also to give the other fish a chance to survive. If only they were easier to catch. What is it that you're doing here exactly? A lot of different things. Building boats, fishing paddles, and other tools, but mostly banging my head on the wall to find a better way to optimize our fishing technique. Talking to you, Bram. Same here. <sighs> All right. Three minutes. I don't know what the hell I got time for. Let's see if we can hit this right quick. Doubtful, but let's see if we can hit get over there real quick. Is that my like? Ride you? No. That's right, I got my own wings. I'm gonna make it. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. Whoa, whoa, easy. Ah, made it. I don't think we've met. I know. I am Vizel, the Traveler. You are the so-called Ulukai. Right. Something like that. Ulukai. Where are you traveling to? Travel has become tricky on Adolfa. I don't know if you've heard, but there's an invasion going on. You don't say. What are you doing here? Thinking about the past, mostly. I wanted to find every Orem trail on Adelpha. But then the invaders came. Hmm. What a shame. I owed Orem that much. Orem trails, huh? What are they? I named these plants after my partner, Orem. We used to travel together, but Orem reverted on a dangerous trail near Palana. Orem and I have been documenting these trails since we were young lovers, freshly out of Kizar. They are fascinating plants. Did you know you can find them across the whole planet? Well, so that's it? You were just writing about them? Like studying them, or...? Oh, no. Orem and I, we didn't receive an education in Procreana and all that. We used to live off the Helidium trade, you see? You can collect Halidium at the end of each trail, so we started to travel everywhere we could find them. Became quite the experts. So, what are you doing up here? Orem's Hazardous took possession of this lighthouse, so I can have a better view of the trails. I'm sad we will never finish what we started together. Care if I pick up where you left off? Please do. 
That would be a blessing from the gods. Report back to me once in a while. I want to know everything about the trails you find. I better get going, Bizo. Okay. What the? And I'm out of time. Dang. Well, that was Outcast, the new beginning. Ooh, March 15th, that's coming up. We'll see. We, we, we might pre-order that on the list. Or we might get it. I don't know. We'll see how you guys like it. But uh, thanks for tuning in. And until the next time, I will catch you all on the flip-flop.